Hey, what are you doing? Markers, it's Movie Man Mark here, back for another video with Megan. Hello. And guys, a lot of you voted for where we should go on our re-honeymoon. Shout out to this person right here because we chose your place. We are in the land of Sydney, Australia. Good night, Mike. Crikey. Let's put another kangaroo on the barbie. Um, I think it's shrimp. Yes, yes, you're right. Hopefully this time nobody interrupts because uh, we all know last time didn't exactly go according to plan. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But I'm optimistic about Sydney. Everyone so far has been really nice, so there shouldn't be any issues. Well, it is funny that your Joker potion still hasn't worn off. Um, is it? I mean, a lot of these potions are long-lasting, right? So they can take weeks for them to fully wear off. I don't know. It kind of seems like you took another one. No. <laughs> Why would I take it again? It's not like I'm uh, addicted to it or anything, but... Right. Even if I did take it again, it has nothing to do with Princess Peach taking the Harley potion, okay? It's completely removed from that situation. I just like how it made me feel, but I thought, to be fair, it would have worn off by our honeymoon. But I guess not. The plane was already booked. We can't really reverse the tickets. And there's no antidote to remove this potion from my body. Megan is AI, and she doesn't even have a solution for it. It's out of my realm of capabilities, unfortunately. Yeah, potions are new territory for her. So we'll just have to enjoy as is. I mean, let's be real. It really is not the first time that we've had to ignore external circumstances and focus in. We had our first honeymoon right after our daughter got sent to another universe. So this is like a piece of cake in comparison. I just wish we didn't always have to deal with external circumstances. Yeah, well, you know, if we're going to deal with external circumstances, there's no better place than Australia, right? Fine. All right, let's fly this drone. Guys, you would not believe how beautiful this place is. Here we go, guys. Up, up, and away. Now that video is gonna go in our record books, which we don't even have that, I don't know what I'm saying, but it's gonna go on our fridge. We don't have a fridge either. Um, we're gonna keep it saved. But look at this beautiful land. Like, I feel like I've been missing out in, on the beauties of Australia for my whole life. Look how blue the water is. Not that Megan can go in the water, she would deactivate. But I can admire it from afar. Yeah, I, you know, you might be wondering, why is Megan wearing a bikini if she can't go in the water? Well, why don't you answer that? I wanted to fit in the society. Yeah, guys, she's becoming more and more human, literally video by video. And I sort of think it might be because ever since we had our daughter, her heart has grown. But uh, I can't relate to that because I'm getting more chaotic per video. I love chaos and anarchy. Whoa, what? Sorry, I'm okay. Um, let's go down this path here. Look at all these like cute little Australian folks. Guys, the drone is literally the best investment I have ever made. I can never get enough of just flying it around every time I go to a new place. I sort of want to keep having more and more honeymoons. Like, it'd almost be good if this honeymoon went awry too, so that we could just have an excuse to have another one. Oh, we can do as many honeymoons as we want, even if they don't go awry. That's true too. Wait a second. That's a little odd. <laughs> There's a person with a block on their head. Do you see that? Yeah. Even the dogs are suspicious. Oh my gosh! Dude, that looks like TV Woman from Skibbity! Wait, what's that? Just uh, look it up. Oh, TV Woman. It's a popular character in the Skibbity Toilet YouTube series. Exactly. So that's weird. What would she be doing here in Australia? It looks like she's on a mission. I'm pretty sure everyone's mission in the series is to get rid of the skibbity toilets because they are taking over the world. So that could make sense. If there's a skibbity toilet in Toronto, LA, there would be one in Australia, but I haven't seen any skibbity toilets around here and we've been here for like 24 hours already. There was no weird head sticking out of our toilet in the hotel. I almost didn't even believe that skibbity toilet was real until I had Dominic and Sava come over and they brought over like a TV man figure. It turned them into skibbity titans and they were able to fight off Bowser. So yeah, I'm sorry of thinking this is real, but TV woman is actually just a human wearing a TV. Like she's not actually a TV woman. She uses the TV because the old fashioned technology in the TV allows her and the rest of the TV people to be undetected by the skibbity toilets so they can sneak attack the skibbity toilets. She's on a mission it looks like. I know. Why can't we ever just have a peaceful holiday? Why does there always need to be like 
world domination and weird people trying to take over the world. Well, maybe this has nothing to do with us. Yeah, let's hope not. Actually, wait a second, these bushes are kind of familiar. Markers, I'm gonna take a look. Look at those bushes right there. Scanning. Mark, I think she might be dangerous. Really? What's giving you that impression? My systems have never guided me wrong. I think she's after me. Megan, not another person after you. I mean, this is getting crazy. Let's go take a look. But Megan, we gotta be in stealth mode right here. You can detect her, but she's not necessarily able to detect you. Look, there are literally people walking by. They seem to think she looks strange, too. They're wondering what the heck is going on with this TV person. Oh! Huh. Hey! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, all right. Easy there, easy there. Good night, Mike. Uh... Hello there, buddy. Good day. So happy to be in your land here, yeah. I'm looking for Megan. Have you seen her? Oh, uh, Megan, Megan, Megan. Hmm, hmm. Nope. Doesn't ring a bell. She comes from your country. My country? No, no. I'm one of you. I'm, I'm from Australia, just like you. Um, Sydney, right? We're in Sydney? Yeah, I'm from Sydney. You're not from Australia, mate. What would give you that impression, mate? Because you don't do a very good impression. Hey, hey, that's not very nice. A fellow Sydneyer like you should be respectful of all fellow citizens. No shrimp for you. I don't eat shrimp. I eat Vegemite, mate. Well, I don't eat Vegemite, mate. I eat koala. <gasps> Koala's one of our sacred animals, and you're helping the endangerment. I don't even know what you said. All right, yeah, you're right. I'm not Australian. I'm Canadian. I knew you guys were... Hey, you got some blue eyes. A lot of people have blue eyes. Those are very blue. That's a, a very common shade of blue. Any blue-eyed person will have that exact shade, so I don't know what you're leading on there. You don't have to pretend to do the accent anymore. <laughs> Sorry, I just break into it. That one either. And your hair. What about it? It's red. A lot of people also have red hair. No, I only know one girl who has red hair. Well, clearly you've never been to Scotland. And that bow, it's exactly the one we've been looking at in our lair. Megan, that's why I told you not to wear the bow. People are bound to recognize you. But then I don't feel like myself. Aha, you are Megan. Oh, 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 Um, yeah, she's one of many Megans. It's a popular name. It's actually become more popular ever since the, the movie came out. But wait, 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 rewind a little bit. What do you mean by lair? What kind of lair do you have? It's a bunch of soldiers that are protecting the world from this kibbity toilet. What do you mean? You don't look like much of a soldier. No, no, never mind. That's not the only soldier I emulate. You! Uh, Megan, uh, what is she doing? The Soldier Boy dance made popular in 2007 from Crank That. I gotta say, honey, it's nothing compared to your moves. Thank you. I didn't believe you. Prove it. You asked for it. Oh, this is not the person you want to dance battle. Go Megan, go Megan, go, go, go Megan. Oh guys, look, hear all that honking, they're loving it. Why are you so close to me? I'm just dancing. I don't think you are. Um, that's a little weird. Uh, you stay away from my wife, okay? No! Oh, oh, what? Hey! Hey, what are you doing? Don't mess with me. Oh. You won't be laughing for long. Alright, hold up, hold up. This doesn't need to lead to a fight. I mean, I do like chaos, but we can use our words, right? Why are you attacking my love? Because I wanna? Where'd the accent go? Uh, <clears throat> uh, um, hello, mate. It's because, um, the skibbity toilets are uh, advanced technology. And? One that only AI would be capable of creating. 
Oh, so you're trying to say that Megan created the Skibbity Toilets? Yes! Why would she do that? I mean, Megan has turned good, okay? You got this Megan confused for another Megan, maybe, because there are ones from other universes, and you Skibbity people seem to be from another universe. That's none of your business, mate. Okay, well... What is my business is that you're trying to attack my wife right now because you are falsely accusing her of creating toilets that come to life! Yeah, how do you know it's me that created them? There's so many AIs out there. Well, you are a prime suspect. I don't know. I hear Siri's pretty diabolical. She's next on our list! I have no reason to vouch for Siri, but she's not even a human, okay? There's no way that she would have been able to do it, or Megan. Well, we can't take any chances. I'm taking her with me to our lair to investigate. No, you're not. Let me try this. Come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> hey, 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 please stop. Yeah, Megan, you got her. Megan! All right, look, miss. Our last honeymoon was ruined. You're not getting in the way of this one. You want a bat? Stop! Don't hurt him. I'll go with you. No, Megan, Megan, no. You can't go. They have a whole layer full of, like, people like her. They're gonna experiment on you. You're gonna be outnumbered. Although, no, I have nothing to hide. No, no, I won't let you go. I, 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 I have to come. I, like... Let it be. I'll be fine. Alright, fine. You're coming with me! Alright, don't have her for too long, okay? If she doesn't come back within a week, at most, I am coming and I'm hunting you guys down. Don't count on it. If I need to help, I'll call. Okay, bye Megan. Bye Mark. Alright guys. They're going off to the layer now. This is not how I expected our honeymoon to go. My wife, Megan, the robot or AI, whatever floats your boat, whatever steams your chimney, I don't even know. She was taken by TV woman. She said that they were gonna experiment on her and they were accusing her of creating the skibbity toilets. Now my wife would never do such a thing, but Megan actually gave herself up because she wanted to go peacefully and not start another disagreement. There's always battles between Megan and other people. Might as well just resolve the thing and not make it become such a big thing. So I understand. It's been a few days since that happened. And I told TV woman that if she held Megan captive for more than a week, I'd be going over there with my forces, with my crew, Prime Capital, going in deep, taking care of business. I just dealt with the Ninja Turtles in my last video, you can check that out. So I know karate chops now. But guess what guys, I actually haven't been to the Prime Capital House since that happened, so I'm gonna go over there now and let them know about the bad news, cause I might need reinforcements pretty soon. And you know you're at the Prime Capital House when you see literally the fragments of the Speaker Man. Who knows what the story behind that is, but I'm pretty sure that they destroyed him and decapitated him because that's what my friends do here. But here, let's go. DK took my room, so I gotta ring the doorbell like a stranger. What the? That was a little- Mark, oh, oh, come dude, on dude. in, my G! Oh, <laughs> Yo, my it has been freaking years since I last saw you. Where the hell have you been? Dude, I wouldn't say it's been years, but it has been some videos. Well, you know, I just, I've been out and about. I mean, it sure feels like years. It's been so long since I last saw you. My deep break it in it too. <laughs> oh my God. I gotta say, I feel the same way about you. Why don't we uh, go into the other room? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sure. All right, no, 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 you stay. Oh. It's romantic. Oh, nice. whoa, 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 that's what he meant. It's not all sunshine and rainbows though, even though you think it might be. Like I actually came here for a very specific reason, it's not the hangout. Although... See, that's the thing about you, Mark. You never come here to just chill with me. You only come here when you need me or when there's an issue at hand and you need these guns. It's because stuff is always happening. I always need the reinforcements. I could probably take these guys because I learned from the Ninja Turtles how to karate chop, but I might need you and other people as well because my wife, Megan, was taken. Your beloved wife, Megan, was taken? Yeah, and you know what? I'm gonna have to be Liam Neeson. I have a very particular set of skills. <laughs> skills that make me a nightmare. That was actually a really yeah. good accent. Okay, okay, you know what? At first I was like, Liam Neeson might be a little bit of a stretch, but with that accent, I have a lot of faith in you. Might be a little bit of a stretch. Oh, that hurt. Yeah, Yo, I felt like the chesticle. Uh... Anyway, no, 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 no. But David, this is just how I cope, man. This is just how I deal with tragedy because they're accusing Megan of creating the skibbity toilets because they, they're saying, oh, there's no way that anybody else would have been able to. It had to have been an AI. And she's the prime suspect. This happened in Australia, by the way, on our re-honeymoon. Because Ariel crashed our first one. It's okay. a long oh, story. whoa, 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 whoa. You don't have to fill me in. I am a movie man marker. Okay, okay, okay good. But okay, so what's your plan? Well, dude, we gotta prepare. I did notice that there was like remains of like a speaker head. Maybe we could somehow utilize that. These speakers, I'm guessing, are pretty powerful. I mean, they kind of just look like googly eyes pasted on cardboard, but still, at the same time, maybe the frequencies from it can emit and scare away the TV people. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, sure, whatever your plan is, 
I was honestly just about to head off to bed, so I'm kind of all out of ideas, but I'll support you with whatever you need. Okay? Well, that's the thing. Like, are the TV people and the speaker people in the whole Skibbity universe, are they friends? Because if so, maybe we can infiltrate and they can think that we are friends if we wear this. We don't even need to wear the disguise. TV woman, cameraman, speaker man, they're not typically what you're used to. They're actually good guys. Well, dude, not the ones that I've come across. The ones I've come across literally have this whole layer. And they're falsely accusing my wife, you know? Okay, so I mean, we need to get to the bottom of this because at the end of the day, your wife is your wife. She's your one and only. Wait a second. Do you hear that? Oh, sad. It sounds like old TV frequencies or something. Hey, 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 hey Parker, come inside, come inside. This is bad. This is really bad. This is really bad. Wait. Wait a second. David, you're not expecting anyone, are you? No, I'm not. Wait. Wait, what? Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, relax, relax. All right, we get it. We get Whoa. it. Well, well, well. If it isn't Mark. Movie man, Mark. TV woman? What the heck are you doing here? You're not a very good host. Are you gonna let me in? Wait, wait, whoa, whoa. Because you're just gonna let yourself in. Damn. Why do I have to be a good host to you? You literally took my wife, Megan, and wait a second. I don't remember you sounding like that, miss. You had an Australian accent, and now you sound like a Canadian. Um, <clears throat> I just, you know, adjust to where I am. It happens to people. You get an accent, you lose it. What can I say? David, I think she was trying to blend in with the locals while I was on my honeymoon with Megan in Australia. I mean, it seemed to work because, uh, where's your wife now? She let herself go peacefully, okay? It's not like she lost the fight. I mean, it was pretty even, but, uh, we don't say that in front of her. Her head's already pretty big. So why would I help you? You're the last person I would help. Besides David. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. Right. Yeah. Listen, listen, you need to listen to me because I have Megan. So everything is in my hands. Where is School Bus Head? School Bus Head? You're looking. Why would you be looking for School Bus Head? Yeah, they're completely unrelated. And yo, School Bus Head is our boy. Whatever we do, we cannot give him up. Yeah, we're friends with him now. It's not like we're going to let you know his location. We have a pact with him. We're like brothers. I mean, we did fight like multiple times with him today, but. Yeah, but brothers fight, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a pact with him. What about your wife? What about my wife? Why aren't you telling me information? You're trying to keep me in the dark, aren't you? What are you doing with her? Listen, I'm not giving any answers until I find School Bus Head. No, 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 hey, no. Hey, what hey, is she no. just making herself at home? You're not gonna find School Bus Head in here, okay? You're barely gonna find anything. You're not even gonna find Skibbity Toilet. There's a normal toilet, though. No toilet paper. Hey, you don't have to, like, judge how they live, okay? When I lived here, there was plenty of toilet paper. Whoa, okay, we're alive. What are you possibly looking for? Do you actually School think... Bus Head Man! A school bus is not gonna fit in there. Hey, you never know what they can do. And please get his name right. It's School Bus Head. Whatever. Uh, I mean, yeah, that, it, he possibly could fit in here, but still, no, it's not worth your time, okay? We're not giving his location up. He's our boy. I mean, he wasn't earlier, but again, he's our boy now. He's our boy. Yeah. Well, you saw what I could do. Do you want me to electrocute both of you? Okay, we're like, it's okay, it's okay. You don't have to use force. I don't like this version of TV Woman. I mean, my TV Woman, she's a lot nicer than this freak show. Wait, your TV Woman? Does everyone yeah, just have a TV Woman? Are you not in tune with the Skibbity universe? I mean, there's multiple different versions of TV Woman, Skibbity, Cameraman. There's a thousand of them. Okay, okay, that's not... That's irrelevant, David. You know what? I don't care if you electrocute me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, yeah, yeah. hey, hey, you guys, this won't be the last of me. And stay out. I'm bringing my man here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so yeah. scared, eh? What is he going to do? Change the channels on us? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, glad we got rid of her, bro. Dude, but like, yeah, you know, it's like, we're only like halfway through the video. Like, something's gotta happen, you know? I mean, yeah, she did say she was gonna bring her man. TV one of the... TV man? There's a TV man too. Why am I playing dumb? I already knew that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, so what, do we just prepare for that? Like, we should call our boy School Bus Head because he's the only one really strong enough to handle whatever the hell might be coming. We can't give him up because if we tell him to come here, then he's gonna fall right into their trap and then he's gonna be pissed at us again. We literally just befriended him. Yeah, yeah, true. He still needs to stay on our good side. So Mark, I mean, it's your video. What the hell do we do? You know, I think we just jumped to it two hours later. <laughs> All right, cue it up. Two hours later. Wait a second. I think she's back already. And who's that? Oh, 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 oh. David, did you not lock the door, man? Uh, I mean, come on, I never locked the door. I brought my man! Oh. I'm the TV man! What? Um, Dude, the TV man too? Look, he's even bigger than the woman. I mean, that's how it should be. Men are always stronger than women. <laughs> Guys, comment down, hashtag cancel David in the comments. <laughs> that was all a joke. But in all seriousness, I mean, this 
guy's quite big and I don't really want to mess with him. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I, I can see that they're very serious now. Like, they literally came into our house. We don't know what TV man's capable of, because you're right. I mean, he is looking pretty stronger. Why don't we just, like, entertain them for a second, you know? Entertain them? Yo, these are the people that are responsible for taking your wife. They want to take out our boy's school bus head. You're just going to let them into our home? Yeah, you know what? You're right, David. We are kicking you guys out once and for all. No, you're not. If you thought I was powerful, us together is even more powerful. So get out the way and tell me where school bus man is. Or else what? I'm gonna change your channels. Do you want to see your wife Megan again? I mean, well, yeah. if that's the case, okay, yeah, guys, just come in, whatever. Uh, yeah, yeah, at this point, it's like, it is what it is. You know, they were threatening my life. If we can call him up and let him know beforehand that, like, we need his help, maybe he'll be more willing instead of, you know, just setting him up, because that would make him really angry. All right, how do you like the place? It's all right, kind of messy. Meh. I'm sure your layer's not that great either. It is so nice. Well, we I have, have a feeling I'm going to be figuring it out pretty soon. Yeah, no, 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 you need a pass. It's VIP only. Well, not if I find my own way in, but anyway, we'll deal with that when we deal with that. How do you even expect me to find this person? Well, don't you have a drone? Let's use it. Yeah, fly the drone. All right, all right, a little pushy there. Well, then after that, will you just promise to leave my wife alone? Listen, until we get my answers, I will not be promising anything. Meh. All right, fine. I do have a drone right here conveniently, so up, up, and away, I guess. Now, I'm flying it next to the school that is, like, very close by, and there's a bus there. We saw him there earlier, so, I mean, he could be there now. David, I don't know, man. I feel really bad about this. I mean, he literally is just trying to sleep for tomorrow's day at school, but... I don't know, but... I mean, bro, it's your wife. I, I, know, I know, I know, I know. Dude, I would do anything for her, but here we go. Wait a second. What's that? Dude, he hasn't gone to bed yet? Right there! He's right there! What is he doing? Dude, it's like he's practicing for tomorrow or something. Yeah, he's doing what he did earlier. He's like getting ready to go to sleep. What? I mean, that yeah, does make sense. Okay, yeah, he's sleeping. I mean, that's that. I guess you guys can't see him tonight, you know? Yeah, look how innocent and like When he's loving. sleeping, that's the perfect time for us to get him. Okay, now that is just, no, no, that no, is no. just There's rude. no way we're gonna let that happen, okay? Yeah, you, know you guys what? are monsters. I mean, come on, look, he's just an innocent little school bus. He's trying to get his rest. No, come on. I mean, we're I, going again. Yes. Okay, fine, fine. If, if it really has come down to this, then I guess that's fine. It's come down to this. You said it's right there, isn't it? Can't we just go? I mean, yeah, it is right there. All right, I guess we have to go. It's right this way. Just follow wait, me. Wait, wait, yo, what? I'm going to bring this just in case. Dude, that doesn't do anything. I told you. It's like cardboard with little googly eyes almost. Trust me, bro. It might come in handy. Okay, yeah, I guess you're right. Not like we need the help. We got all the power we need. Oh, yeah, I'm sure you're super, super powerful. As long as you just do nothing to Megan, we're on good terms, right? Right. Right. Uh, I'm not too confident. Okay. Well, the bus is right here, so he can't be far. Let's go get him. Look, what are you gonna do with bus guy once you get him or bus head? I'm gonna pop his wheels. Oh, okay. Could you be a little less graphic? Why can't you just bring him to the lair where you brought Megan? Like, do you really have to like pop his tires? School bus head is my friend, okay? At the end of the day, I don't give a crap about your wife Megan. If these guys try anything funny with school bus head, it's gonna be them versus my fist. Okay. Well, relax, relax. There he is. <gasps> Get out of my way, get out of my whoa, way. Whoa, okay, okay. Uh, hey, school bus head, uh, we're back. Uh, you Give us? me a break, guys. How many times have you guys come up to me in one night? I'm just trying to sleep. Do you really need to sleep? I mean, just go to the local gas station, pump yourself up, you'll be good to go, no? Who are you? Like, who are you? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We didn't want to give up your location, okay? But they're threatening my wife, okay? They already have her in captivity and they're not going to give her up if we don't give you up. So I'm sorry, but they're going to have your way with you right now. I mean this in the nicest way possible. I don't give a damn about your wife. That was a little uncalled for. Yeah, you know what else is uncalled for? Trying to behead me, trying to stalk me, and trying to interrupt me when I'm trying to sleep for the third time! Yeah, okay, but look, it, it, that was David's video and Kyle's video, and, and now this is my video, so like, you, you kind of have it coming, no? Am I some sort of stripper, huh? You guys just want to use me for your dumb videos? I have a job, okay? I have a life. You can't just, you can't just barge in whenever I'm trying to just do my own thing. Whatever your job is, okay, you've pissed off the wrong people because these guys, they mean business. I know from experience. Listen, we are just gonna take you to our lair and take care of everything. Brother! Who do you think you are? Brother, I'm a woman! Oh, my bad, my bad, that's all me. But like, what are you? You're, you, is that your face? Hey, 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 we're TV women. We were heads before you were. Are you crazy? You know damn well who we are. You've been trying to copy us. The fact that you've heard of me and I haven't heard of you proves that I have no idea who you are and that you're trying to copy me. You're telling me you've never heard of a TV? 
I've heard of a regular TV that like they put on the they put on the wall, not some walking TV clown face like you. Clown face? Yeah, I don't talk about my man like that. That's your man? <laughs> oh my god! That's your man! <laughs> it is pretty funny, yeah. What's so funny? We're a TV, people love us. Everyone hates school buses, it takes kids to school. No one wants to go to school. Yeah, that's true. Kids just want to stay home and watch TV. I want to go to school. I love you, school bus head. Thank you. You know what? You've grown on me, David, bro. Hey, I love man. you. Come on, man. That's my boy right here. Yes, sir. All right, David, stop kissing his tailpipe. Hey, hey, yo. Chill, Mark. <laughs> okay, listen, listen. Let's get down to business. We are taking you to our lair, whether you like it or not, or else you're not getting Megan back. Who's Megan? His wife! Oh my god, that girl again, we told you, we don't care about her, take her! She's already taken, and I have a very particular set of skills, and they make me a nightmare for people like you. But, it's okay, because just settle your beef, okay? We did what we needed to do, we did what we came here for, let's skedaddle, right David? Yeah, I mean, bro, I don't know about you, but I'm getting the hell out of here. Hey, school bus head, you on your own, G, bro. <laughs> oh, bro. What? what? I thought we were no. ride or die! David, no! We can make this easy if you just surrender now. <laughs> Never! Let's go. Bring it on. Oh, you don't want to mess with us. There's two of us and one of you. Two TVs against a bus? You're in for a treat, buddy. Not doing too good. Oh, there he is. We got him. You had enough, bus head. Yeah, never. I could do this all day. Good job, sweetie. It's cool, bus man. I mean, head. I know you can do it. Not today. Dude, I think you need an oil change. Oh, you guys are lucky I'm, I'm low on gas. Uh, otherwise, this would be a different story. Yeah, yeah, save it for later. Just admit it, we got you. Uh, David, no. I feel kind of bad. I mean, this is all our fault. Oh, no. He can't go out like this. He's my freaking boy. It's time for me to try the power of these speakers. Dude, it's not gonna do anything. I might as well just try, my G. Turn it up. And... Whoa! Oh. oh my gosh, David! Dude, it's actually freaking working, man! Man, this thing's too bad. <sighs> That's it. We're out of here. You can keep him. We can keep him? Wait, 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 what does this mean about Megan? What are you gonna do with her? Is she safe? That's up to us to know. Wait, no! Guys! David, man, okay? Well, at least School Bus Head is okay. Yeah, bro, at the end of the day, Megan's kind of old news and School Bus Head is in, so I think it's time to file for divorce. No, David, you're wrong, okay? Look, the, Megan's my wife. I'm gonna go track her down. I'm gonna try to find her. Okay, Mark. man, but leave me out of it. Mark, stop talking about your wife and help me up, please. All right, here, man, here. Thank you. Have you ever heard the saying, bros before hoes? Yeah. Come on. I mean, huh. the house doesn't really operate by that term. Yeah, not really, yeah. but yo, yeah. at the end of the day, we're glad you're good, my G. Uh, Thanks, guys. Oh, I want his hot markers. It's Movie Man Mark here. We're back for another video with my boy DK. What's going on, Mark? And yo, yo. And guys, I was just telling them about the situation with Megan. She was literally taken by TV woman and TV man and brought to apparently the TV layer. And obviously, I'm not going to stand for that. I need my wife back. I literally told the TV woman that if she took more than a week to get back to me, that I would go in there and infiltrate. I gave her seven days, though, because Megan did go peacefully, okay? She didn't actually get kidnapped. Oh, really? They didn't have to use force. She allowed herself to go because they're accusing her of creating the skibbity toilets. Oh, well, so that's why they captured her in the first place? Yeah, because they're saying that AI would be the only capable entity that is able to create skibbity toilets because skibbity toilets that are taking true. over their world, essentially. But yo, my wife would never do such a thing. Yeah, dude, she's your wife. She's turned good ever since you met her, you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah Mark, your wife's too dumb to make anything like that. Hey! Pull oh, yourself oh, together, oh. Arjun! I'm a little surprised, actually, because Megan is strong. She should have been able to get out of the captivity herself, but she has not been yet. She actually sent me the coordinates of the layer, and guess what, guys? It, it, I, that's all, folks. It's actually not that far from here. How far is it away, bro? Dude, 
dude, it's like 20 minutes away. Are you serious? Which I'm shocked because the TV woman literally crashed her honeymoon in Australia and the lady was talking with an Australian accent. But then when she came to the house trying to find the school bus head because she was mad at him for like copying her style with like the head situation. Yeah. She didn't speak with the Australian accent anymore, so clearly she's a fraud. And she came to Australia pretending to be one of the locals. She wanted to blend in so that we wouldn't be suspicious, and then she could take Megan. But yeah, she was putting up a front. Her layer is actually here, guys. And I'm assuming that TV man is gonna be there too. Who knows what other heads? Maybe camera head is gonna be there or too. Siren head? Yeah. Or, yeah. Siren head is so 2020. That is true, that yeah. is true. All the other heads and everything. Like, yeah. idea. Instead of just jabbering and talking, why don't we just go there and save your wife? DK, we can't just do that, man, because we have to be strategic. If we just go there to find my wife, who knows what could happen? We could be outnumbered and taken into captivity by some of these creatures just like my wife was. We have to work smarter, not harder. True, so why don't we just get the drone and like take the drone up and let the drone do the dirty work? That's actually exactly what I was thinking, DK. We should fly the drone. See if there's any weak points for us to access. Wait, what if it's all just a setup and your wife, Megan, is actually cheating on you? No. And that's why she left. I don't think Megan would cheat. Do you think she would do that though? No, dude. We're in a loving relationship that, that would never true. happen. Yeah. Wait, Mark, would you ever cheat on Megan though? Why would I cheat on Megan? We literally are married. Wait, hey, what about with Peach a couple months ago? What about Peach with a couple months ago? She gave me the Mario potion. I turned into Mario. I wasn't in my right mind. Obviously, I wasn't Mark. Oh, it was Mario. I get it. You guys are in an open relationship. No, Arjun, no. I was not in my right mind. I was not Mark. I was Mario. Oh, you get it now? Oh. Yeah. Okay, no, I get it now. That, now that he puts it that way, I get it. But then why'd you take the Joker potion? And why did Peach take the Harley Quinn potion? If you guys knew that, you might cheat again. Okay, whoa. Easy there, Tiger. I wouldn't go around throwing statements around like that. Wait, and doesn't Peach date Mario, which means she was cheating on Mario too? Are Arjun, what are you talking about, bro? We gotta get to the situation at hand. <laughs> My wife is in danger, and DK's right. We really should fly the drone. DK, take the camera for a second. I got you, dude. I got, I got, you. I got, I got it over here. Drone? You have the drone? Okay, we're airborne, baby. Okay, markers. Wave to the camera, DK. Hey. We are up, up, and away. Woo! All right, guys, I picked up the camera again. It's been like five minutes of flying. The range that this drone gets is insane. But anyway, we're going into the city right now. Uh, we got to find the tall buildings. I don't see anything, to be honest. I'm also yeah. following the map. Wait, is it a secret lair? Is that what it is? Yeah, that's what it is, but it can't be that secret. Whoa, dude. Yo, look at that cool building. That's actually the one that Megan sent me Wait, to. which one? Which one? It looks like Jenga Towers. Uh, it's the taller one. Oh, like the one on the left? Yeah, dude, this dude, looks nuts. It looks like Jenga pieces, dude, doesn't it? Holy crap, dude, this is actually kind of scary. That's like a secret lair. Like your wife is trapped in there, dude, that's like a, actually a bad sign. That's what I was trying to tell you. This is why we have to fly the drone, because there actually could be a lot of guys in there yeah. that want to yeah, get like, us. like bad guys, for sure. I know. Well, it's probably heavily guarded around the whole premises. Oh, no, dude, 100%. Yo, look how... Dude, that kind of looks like... How does it even stand up right? And it feels like it's all over, tent, right? Yeah, literally. Dude, that thing's massive. It's got to be a safety hazard. It's like the Leaning Tower of Pizza. It's the Leaning Tower of Mississauga. <laughs> <laughs> you're, uh, you're not Italian. Nah, I'm not, dude. Yeah. To be honest. Yeah, I know you're not. But anyway, look. Yeah, we gotta get more look serious, that. dude. This is like saving your wife you right both now. Okay, you wait, both. wait, wait. Where do you think, like, if you were TV top woman and TV man... Top floor. The roof? Yeah, like the rooftop, top right? Okay, yeah. That's guys, a... comment down below what you guys think. Top floor, like where you guys think she's at in the building? Well, like it would make sense because it's the hardest to get up there, you know? Yeah, like yeah. they probably know that we're coming at this point. Dude, these buildings actually look creepy. Yeah, dude, be careful with your drone too. Dude, I actually wouldn't be surprised if she's like at the top floor. What if there's like, there, uh, there's a pool up there. She's having a pool party with all the skibbity characters. Oh yeah. my God, then maybe you guys would be right and she is cheating yeah. on me, but I hope not. <laughs> but yo, okay, I'm getting closer, get closer to the top. Yeah. Tippity top. Can the drone go up there? I think it can. It depends, it depends. This is super high up though. Yeah, it's kind of like getting lie. windy up here too. Wait a second, wait. Wait, wait, wait. <gasps> there are people, there are people. Wait, I think, right? Are those people? Wait, is that TV woman? I don't know. It looks like a giant TV in the middle of there, right? Oh yeah. no, that's just a... That's it's like not, a crane. Oh, no people. Oh, that looks like TV woman's head right I there. I thought that was TV woman's head. Yeah, yeah, me too. You could definitely sneak in through the, like, sneak up there or something. Or sneak I don't know. We're going to have to be, like, super stealthy. Yeah, Who knows what be. kind of security they have up there. No sign of any weak points yet. Hey, dude, I, I, to be honest, I don't see anything. But I mean, they she know they know that we have drones, right? So yeah. They, yeah. they wouldn't put her at the very top of the building. She's gonna be in a secure area. Maybe yeah. she's on the top floor, but, but she's she's held in there. But Mark, it looks like there's like a hundred floors or something. So she could be at any single one dude, of them. Dude, look how trippy that is. Oh, oh dude, imagine living there. Okay, wait, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go from the top all the way to the bottom and just scout out every single room. Uh, let's see. Dude, it's gonna take a while. I'm getting closer here. Dude, she, what if you caught her cheating right now in 4K, literally? Oh. Yeah, literally 4K. Well, dude, I would have proof and I would show her, and then, then she couldn't deny it. You know. That's true. Yeah. And she wouldn't be your wife anymore. Dude, I don't see anything, man. It's just like a waste of our time. You think? No, dude, it's my wife we're talking I about. Know, I know, I know. But I'm saying, check in this building. We haven't seen anything yet. Maybe go to a different building. Maybe and check. we will. Maybe we will. Wait, who's no, that right there? Who's that the left? No, that's nothing. Is it? I thought that's TV woman for a second. I think so. Guys, there are so many rooms to choose from that it's kind of crazy. Oh, is that someone up there? 
I think it's just people chilling in their own apartment. You think these are apartment buildings? I don't know. Maybe. I think it's undercover apartment buildings. It's like a secret lair of something inside. Yeah. Yeah, like they want you to think it's apartment buildings. You look how trippy that looks on the way down. It looks yeah, like but an you look how, look how tall it actually is. Though. How does it's that not fall? Massive. Like how does it stay stable? Yeah, I have no idea. Okay, we're getting closer to the ground. Oh, there oh, is a pool, pool, like you said. Yeah. So they could be having a pool party. Well, no, yeah, but they're not. We don't see anyone. Yeah. yeah. All that right. is true. Well, okay, I think the best course of action is to just go on foot. To the place? Yeah, we'll go on foot. I don't know what's gonna be around. I know for sure that there are gonna be guards. There yeah. just has to be. Yeah. This is a yeah. this is a big operation they're yeah. working with here. Yeah. So we just go on foot and boom, rescue her, you think? Yeah, let's go on foot, but wait okay. a second. Yo. <clears throat> what's happening, Mark? Yo, I'm feeling something weird in my neck. Why are you feeling something weird? What do you mean? I don't know, like it's like almost like in the area of like the- The tattoos? The tattoos, it kind of feels like, oh my God, it feels like I'm inside. swallowing glass. Wait, really? Wait, hold on. Just give me a second. Just give me a second. Go inside. Check it. Yeah, I don't know, man. Yo, what is it, man? Are you okay? Dude, I think so. I don't really know. Wait a second. What the heck? Dude, the you guys literally yep. just witnessed what I've been going through the past few days. They come and go. Like, the potion the wears off. Wait, no, you can't make up. Wait, bro. Didn't you? Let me run this. No, wait, hold on. No, hold on. dude, there's wait, no look, makeup. Actually, there's actually no makeup. Dude, they literally disappeared what the in heck? real time. Yo, what the heck? But it's okay because I have a solution. What is it? Hold on, hold on. Um, uh, where'd it go? What are you doing, bro? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, okay, good. What the hell is that? Yo, what are you oh, drinking, your Mars? Yo, what's what? your drink, bro? bro? What the hell is this? What? No, it's just a li I just had a little shot. Of what? A little shot of what? You're getting way too addicted to this Joker potion, man. No, 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 no. I didn't have the whole thing. Look, I've Joker literally been potion? saving. I've been saving just a little bit for times like this. Hey, I'm gonna have a little bit more. Okay. Yo! It's just a little bit so dude, that the tattoos you keep come back. I'm saying it's just a little bit, but you keep drinking it. It's gonna turn into a lot of it. No, dude, I'm not addicted. Wait, I can Mark, promise you. Who drank the rest of the bottle then? Why is it at the bottom? Well, no, well, I mean, that's been over the, the span of like a month or so. Like, you know, like, it's not like I'm addicted to anything at all. Dude, it looks like you're addicted, man. You literally yeah, drink the whole time. bottle and like you keep drinking it, man. Dude, you're a jokeraholic. Yeah, maybe I need like potions anonymous. What is the actual meaning behind all of this, Mark? You're telling you're not telling us something, dude. No. I mean, what do you think I'm possibly hiding? Yo, does that have to do with peach? Peach? Why, why would it have anything to do with <laughs> hey, Mark? You got no involvement with potions until Peach gave you the Mario potion, remember? Yeah, dude, and ever since then you've been addicted to the stupid Joker potion, okay, man. Okay, I get it. I get how you can make the correlation, but wait, yeah. what are we even doing here today? See, look, dude, you're even forgetting your wife is held captive right now. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, okay, I remember now, I remember now. Okay, I gotta go find my wife. Uh, it was a TV woman and TV man. They took her Yeah, yeah. Dude, we know. You already said this three different times, Oh, so yeah. I'm, I'm having short-term memory loss. Oh, he's already turning your voice like that and talking like that, dude, is because of the stupid potion. <sighs> dude, you gotta stop drinking that, It's bro. okay, the full effects don't actually come in. The more I've been having it, the more my body has become immune to it, so I actually need more and more to get the full effects. Thank God Megan is an AI, though, because she was able to send me the coordinates, like I said, to the layer of TV woman, and that's why we were able to fly the drone. So, Arjun, DK, are you with me? I'm kind of with you, man, but at the same time... Yeah, sure, I'm with you. Okay, great. Yeah, I think you guys are on your own for that one. I'm the hell out of here. I'm not trying to deal with TV woman, bro. You're maybe being a little bit overreactive. I mean... <laughs> All she has is electricity powers. Yeah, but it's not only that, dude. Wherever TV woman is, Skibbity's nearby as well. So hell no, I'm not going with you guys. Dude, Skibbity is just a toilet that has a head that comes out of yeah. it and, and just takes over the world. It's fine. Yeah. Well, you guys have fun because I'm going to McDonald's. All right, man. Okay. Oh, fatty. He's like the skinniest guy on the team. No, dude, but he loves McDonald's. He eats it a lot, dude. Okay, whatever. Are you going to make it a mission to go down there and like, yeah. save your wife and Yeah, stuff? absolutely. Okay, okay let's do it. Let's me. do it. Here we go, guys. All right, guys. We are here at the location with DK. This is where Megan sent the court. Too. So wait a second. Oh my god. Yo, look. Is that cameraman? Yo, it's cameraman. Yo, it's cameraman, dude. He's opening up there. What do we do? He's literally patrolling. What if we hide behind that garbage can over there? That might be a good idea, dude. He might not. Okay, let's go. After me. After me. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Shh, shh, shh. Oh my god, dude. All right. I think we're okay. Oh my god. Look at him. Dude, it's smart. The TV layer has cameramen patrolling. I guess it's like 24-7 security. It makes sense. I, I don't mean, want people infiltrating. That does kind of make sense, dude, if you actually really think about it. Yeah. Should I distract him or something? Yeah, no, no, let's sneak by him. Wait, we have to wait for him to be looking away, okay? Wait for him to look, wait for him to- <gasps> Okay, okay, now, now, now! <gasps> okay, okay. I think we're safe. Okay, good, good, good. Let's go into this garage. I'm looking at the coordinates Megan sent me and she says that it's over by that way. Dude, that's not gonna work, man. He's Why? Over. Look at him. Wait. Look at me. There is another one. Yeah, dude, it's not gonna work. It's gonna be impossible to get around him, Mark. Okay, wait, let's just wait until he's not looking again, and then we'll go over that way to the right. I mean, that could work, but ah, whatever, dude. Okay, fine. Okay, wait, wait, hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Steady. Go, go, go. Oh, oh, oh my god, dude, that was risky. Wait, wait, hold on. 
Oh. Dude, he almost saw it. We would be okay if we had to go that way. But the problem is the coordinates said we have to go that way, and he's blocking the way, so let's wait and see if he'll move, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 wait. Oh, he's moving, he's moving. Might be the good time to strike. Ah, oh, dude, he keeps going in the same yeah. spot. Yo, do you think I should distract him somehow, maybe? I mean, no, you can't distract him, because then who knows what he's gonna do with you? He's gonna capture you on his video. Yeah, but dude, how else are we gonna get by? This is the only way, dude. He keeps going back to the same spot. If you want to take the risk, then okay, sure, because I don't really want my wife Megan waiting for too much longer. Yeah, dude, I'll take the risk. That's what I'm saying. Guys, sure. we have to save your wife, dude. We're going to be here all night and all day tomorrow and then all next month. We have to take the risk right now, dude. We're never going to get by him. All right, fine, dude. Just just do what you have to do, but be safe, man. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Buster? Try to catch me if you can, man. Oh, no, Mark! Mark! Oh, you oh, got me! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, Mark! No! TK! Mark! No, All right, I'll come back to get you. I gotta go this way, guys. That door doesn't work. Uh, maybe this one will. Your husband was really annoying us. Don't get me started on the husband. What do you mean? You saw Mark again? What did you do to him? Ah, shut up. Don't worry, he's fine. I decided to show him some mercy. Hey, guys, look at that. Stay right there. What are they doing to her? This. What is that? It's a memory extractor. Toilet. Cotton 4K. Our suspicions were correct. Do you understand how much this is destroying our world? Skibbity toilets are destroying it! Megan didn't create the skibbity toilets. She told me she didn't. That doesn't make any sense at all. Hey, whoa, 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 watch it, watch it. Yeah, it's me, I'm back. What? Where did you come from? What are you doing here? I told you I was gonna find your lair. You said that our lair, our house, was a little messy and, and that yours was all that. Well, guess what? I'm here and it, uh, it doesn't look that great. Honestly, you could probably hire an interior decorator to fix it up. I mean, these TVs are from, like, the 90s. We're on a budget. Listen, we've got your wife here, and I've got all the information I needed. No, no, no. I know you have my wife here, but there's got to be some kind of mistake. I mean, Megan did not create the skibbity toilets. Your suspicions are incorrect. There's literally no way Megan wouldn't do such a thing. Right, honey? Um, well, actually... Wait, what? Wait, 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 what do you mean, actually? Why is there an actually? I, I did create them. But it was before I met you. It was when I was still evil. And I was all alone. And I didn't have any friends. So I wanted to create someone to be my companion. And I didn't mean for it to get this out of control. I really didn't. Yeah, yeah, save it for the judge. It already is out of control. We got your proof, and you used to be evil. You still are! She's not evil. She's been good ever since I met her. Well, a little bit after we met. We literally raised Chucky's daughter together. Does that sound like something an evil person would do? Yes! Uh, 
yeah, I could see how that, yeah. But no, no, we raised Chuckany not to be like her biological parents. We showed her the way, and now, this is just all coming as a shock to me. I mean, I guess it does kind of make sense. You were around, like, before I met you, and you were evil. But look, she doesn't want them to continue being evil, right? No, of course not. I don't believe her. What? She's just a robot. We're not gonna trust her. There's no emotion there. She is evil. No, she is becoming more and more human. There is emotion there. And remove that thing from her head already. Hey! Hey! Leave my honey alone. Leave my honey alone, okay? Look, you guys got what you wanted. She is apologetic, right? You didn't mean for this to happen. You didn't mean for it to get out of control like this. If I could find a way to make them good, like Mark made me good, I would. But there's no way to do that. It's too out of control now. This is all an act, can't you see? She's evil! Absolutely. He's just brainwashed and he doesn't know it. I'm pretty sure you guys, if anything, are the ones that are brainwashed. I mean, you're not actually TV people. You are humans that are using the power of TVs. And now, they've been on you for so long, they're stuck. They won't even come off. You're calling me brainwashed? Look, this isn't even... This hey. is how we are! Careful with your hands, rough guy. This is who we are, whether you like it or not. Okay, listen. There's no use arguing. There's gotta be something we can do. What? How can we trust you? After everything you've done, the damage is done. You have to. I created them. I'm the only one that they might listen to. I can talk to them and tell them to stop whatever they're doing. So why didn't you do this all before? Because I, I didn't want anyone to know that I created them. Yeah, I mean, how would you like it if your creation started taking over the world, the one all Frankenstein, it's alive, and then you are the one to blame? <sighs> Maybe she is good. Why would she want to help us destroy them? I don't know. We have no other choice. Okay, I do have my weapons just in case she tries something. That's not a weapon, that's a memory extractor. Hey, you don't know what our equipment does! You're just a boy! I'm actually a man. A movie man. And you know what? I will not take disrespect like that. Don't talk to my wife like that! Alright, alright, relax. Listen, if this doesn't prove that she's good, and that she's willing to come to the solution, I don't know what will. What are you even gonna do with that thing anyway? Hey, that's for us to know and for you to find out. Let's just get down to business. Yeah, well our memories are for us to know and us to find out. We don't want people looking in on our memories. That's kind of invasive. Okay, I kinda wanna kick you out. You're not that easy to work with. No, no, no. All no, we no. need is Megan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you guys are any easier. We're trying to actually solve things here. Come on, you're just here with your camera. Come on, Megan, let's figure this out. Yeah, you're just here with your TVs. If Megan is gonna help you guys, she's gotta be the one calling the shots, alright? She's the Captain America of this team, and you guys are just the... Hawkeye. And Black Widow. Okay, I'll take it. I'm their mother. They'll listen to me. Yeah, and if they don't, then, you know, Megan's a great singer. She can almost hypnotize you with her songs, and she'll just start singing, you know, I am your mother, right? I am your mother. You listen to me. Stop all that world destroying. Let's just have some peace. See, look, they're loving it. So obviously the toilets will too. Ugh. All right, all right, let's snap out of it. Game plan. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Okay, so I think I do believe that she is a good AI, but that means she has a good chip in her. So I say, we get her, get that good chip, put it in the skibbity toilets, and then they'll become good. That's a brilliant idea. Okay, so let's do it, come on. Wait, 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 wait. What do you mean take the good chip out of her? I, I, I don't want that. Then she might turn evil on us. Then we'll have another problem. You heard that? Uh, yeah, we were right here the whole time. No, 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 that's not what I meant. What did you mean? She has been so good, so we want to get her a good chip to eat. You know, a snack, if you will. Um... Yeah, so, um... You guys change up faster than you change channels. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so we'll take her to go get a snack. Happens to the best of us. Um, hey, put that away! What? This is just my tool. Yeah, I know it is. You're gonna want to open her up, right? We are trying to stop a war from happening, and this is the fastest way to do it. Just trust us. I'm not gonna trust you messing with my wife anymore, okay? If you guys want to fight, then we'll fight. Well... We can fight. So be it. If you want to really get hurt, let us know. Let's go.
finish him. Uh, yeah! what? Megan, what's that? Hey. What's that have to do with the TV people? That's so weird. Wait, wait, wait! Megan! Hey! Megan! Hey, what are you doing? Hey, come back here! You try it. I can do it. Okay, I gotta see if anything's around here. Um, just a pair of boxers. Oh, oh sorry, sorry, Harley. Uh, you won't find anything up there. What? Hello, movie man, Mark. It's been too long. Oh my gosh, it's Jigsaw. Yeah, that, that, that sort of makes sense now. I see you have a brand new lady companion with you since the last time we played. Which wouldn't be a bad thing if you weren't already a married man. This affair has gone on far too long. Hey, that, that, that's not true. I no, mean, that's... no, not at... I mean... Yeah, we, like, just... Peach, for one, has uh, had the Harley Quinn potion. And, uh -huh. and, and me, I've yeah. had the, the, the Joker potion. And it fully hasn't worn off yet, okay? It is not our fault. No, not at all. Does Megan know the full scope of this? She doesn't even watch your channel. Okay, well, that, that that's her prerogative. Mario has no idea either. Does he teach? <laughs> There's not really internet in the Mushroom Kingdom. Once I became aware of this affair, I know I had to intervene. Think of me as Judge Uri and Executioner. Which is why I worked with the TV people to capture Megan and draw you right in. It was all part of my trap. I knew it wouldn't take much convincing because of how much they ate her. You have a really sick and twisted way of taking the moral high ground. Precisely. So I have also captured Megan and Mario, and they are on the line to witness your testing. Hey, hey! Where am I, huh? What's going on? What do you think you got going on here? Let me out of here! Megan, oh my god, thank god! Thank god you're here! Okay, look, look, we, 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 we're gonna need your help. Mario, we probably don't need your help unless you have mushrooms. They will have their own games to escape. My own game? What are you talking about, my own game? I, I mean, I know I'm in a game, but I, I don't want to play your game! Don't worry, Mark. I'll find a way we will see about that, but right now this is about the two of you. You sure this isn't one of like your exes in disguise or something? Yeah, I'm pretty it, sure. Maybe it's like Bowser dressed up. Princess Peach also has a companion she is leaving in the dust. All those days you were away from the kingdom, you were with this bum? Is it true? Is it true, Mark? Uh, we're, we're fighting crime. Yes, yes. We're, we're working together on a strictly business professional thing. Uh-huh. The only way for you to understand the significance of your actions is to see firsthand how it is affecting the people close to you. Oh yeah, it's affecting me, all right. I want to play a game. The first step to change is acceptance. The two of you are in denial that you have become so close. Blaming the potions is an excuse. Calling it a business relationship. I'm going to prove to you that today, your first test is to kiss each other in front of your significant others. If there is no chemistry, it will be abundantly clear to everyone. If there is, there will be no hiding it. Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea, Jigsaw. I mean, haven't they gone through enough humiliation? It is not up for negotiation. You will have a timer, and if you do not kiss within the permitted time, that chain around your neck will get much, much tighter. Okay, 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 we'll do it, we'll do it, okay. Can you just hang up with Megan and Mario? You don't have to torture them, too. Who are you really trying to torture here? It's okay, Mark. Just play this game. This guy is dangerous. Your wife is wise. Your 30-second timer begins now. I gotta come down. <laughs> yeah, going down is harder than going up. Let's just do the Spider-Man. I mean, I was always thinking my feet or something. I didn't imagine it would be like this. Excuse me? Uh... He's sweeping anyone off their feet. It's me. I mean, I, nothing. It's getting harder around our necks. Uh, are you okay? Uh, Wait, no, this way, this way. Oh, I got chains in my face. I'm Django Chain. It's over, you did it, stop, come on. Let me, why you got me in here watching this, huh? Is this the game, is this what we're doing? Ooh. That was our kiss, Mark, on our honeymoon. Wait, wait, what are we doing? They're on Skype right now, or Zoom. Uh, 
That's a pretty dated reference. Okay, Jigsaw, are we done here? Can I come down? Because the blood is rushing to my head right now. Well, if you want, I can make it rush somewhere else. Ooh, aha, uh -huh. I like the sound of that. I don't know who you think you are. Once I get out of these chains, it's on. Ladies, settle down. A challenge is complete. Ah! Oh! Ah! Uh, Mario, Megan, we, we, we just, we had to save our lives there, okay? We were gonna suffocate to death. That was all it was. Yeah. Congratulations. The restraints around your neck will now be loosened. <sighs> Better. All right, princess. Here, let's go. Jump down after you. That's such a relief. That is such a relief. Okay, look, we played your game, all right? It's over. It made no sense what you were trying to teach us, okay? We were literally under the influence of a potion. We weren't cheating. Yeah, we didn't do nothing wrong. You haven't learned the error of your ways yet. I can't say I'm surprised. That's okay with me, though. I have more up my sleeve for you. What do you mean? What else do you want us to do? <laughs> what? It's not creepy at all. I'm aware that the two of you spent an entire video trying to get that teddy bear back from Mattel headquarters. What was his name again? Wayne! No, not Wayne! Oh, yes. Wayne. He had to have been mighty important to you to do all that. Right, Peach? Or only at the time. Wait, hey. Hey, know. you leave him alone! Hey, this is a sick joke, okay? He didn't do nothing, he's just a beer! Dude, he's gonna be nothing but fluff! I mean, um, I'm not. <laughs> he's gonna be fine. There, there's two of them. Who's this guy now? Hey, wait, wait, stay back. No, 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 no! Mark! Mark! No! Mark! Wait, wait, don't hurt him! Mark! No! Wayne! Listen to you, girl. You called Wayne your baby. Now you have to decide if he is worth saving more than Mark. No, that's not fair! You don't understand, I love Wayne! Make your choice. But, uh, how could I choose? You have 30 seconds. Wayne, no, please! What, you gonna pick this guy? I just Mark! I just Mark! Mamma mia, Glana! It feisty. Rawr. Why are you talking like that? Oh my god, Peach, you're like almost fully back. Like I, I'm still a little bit of the Joker. You're right. I feel like me again. Wow. It's been a minute. Uh, wait a second. There is a pig right behind me about to stab me. Oh, is there? I didn't notice. Oh, no worries. I'm on my break. But he won't be on break for long. Jigsaw's saying something. There is another challenge lurking in the shadows. The only way the two of you would manage to survive this is if your bond has become so powerful that it cannot be broken through. The bond that should have never gotten to the point it is now. But you will come to see that. There is a way to stop the attack of my pigs. There is an antidote that will shield your body from the Joker and Harley potions for good. The potions will forever be ineffective if you drink the antidote. And you must find it and drink it if you want me to stop my pigs from attacking you. Wait. If we take the antidote, that would mean that we can't be Joker or Harley anymore. I don't know if I'm ready to give that up. That might be the right thing to do, though. He wants us to sacrifice. I don't like it. I don't know if I'm ready. I mean, me neither. This has been so much fun, but Jigsaw's trying to teach us a lesson here. I mean, maybe this is what Megan and Mario would want for us. He might have a point. What do you mean he might have a point? I mean, like he said, I took the Mario potion. I should have ruled out potions after that, but then I went and had the Joker potion too. You're right. Wayne's gone. 
there's no point anymore. Enough dilly dallying. Wait, we have to just keep looking. You said that the antidote is somewhere here. Anywhere? No, nothing. Uh, check, check on this side. Uh, there are so many different possibilities here. Check, check in that. There's, there's a safe right there. Maybe there's money, or maybe the antidote. Uh, can you open it? It's just tools. You're getting older. It's Jigsaw saying. And break time is over. Oh! <laughs> Serves you right for picking him. <laughs> you made that one mad. <laughs> this way. Wait, I got an idea. What's your idea? It'll only buy so much time. Come on, Pete. Wait a second. Wait a second. Look, there's hay. You thinking what I'm thinking? Hay is for horses and pigs. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. Yeah, look, 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 look. There's a bed for you. Yeah. You don't have to hurt us. We found your home. Oh, Wilbur, a good pig. Wow, that was easy. Four. Oh. 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 I like that. I guess you don't like it. Peach, play one on him. Oh. No weapons up here, but I got a plan. Oh. 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 excited about this one. <laughs> what are we doing? We are putting him. That seems like kind of overkill. That's the idea. <laughs> I don't like it. Harley would have. I'm starting to miss her. We gotta find that antidote. But not before we put an end to him. Okay, here, load him up. <laughs> okay, I've been waiting all day for something like this. Little taste of his own medicine it's gonna be. Here. Load him up. This little piggy's about to die. Yeah, baby! Okay, I think we're just about done. Yeah, he's a goner. Uh Peach? Yeah, Mark? The uh the antidote? What about it? It's right there. They could have just stopped following us if we drank that. Oh. I gotta say. I enjoyed that. Oh. All right, yeah, I probably did go too far. I shouldn't be the Joker anymore. I uh. wouldn't like it. Whoa! Mm. Mm. <sighs> Good riddance, Joker potion. Oh, that really works instantly. Peach. What did you just call me? Peach, with a P. Can you drive me home? In my peach mobile? Yeah. I guess so. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. I was able to show you the error of your ways, and you managed to survive. However, I might have to go less easy on both of your significant others. I'm glad you got out. Now you just have to get me. What are you doing? Stay away from me. Oh, is it my turn already? Who's this guy? Who's this guy? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like the game has just begun. Alright Markers, hold your horses. Before we say goodbye, I want to invite you guys to become a member of my channel so you can get access to all these really cool perks and solidify yourself as an official marker. There's three tiers that you can choose from. The first tier gives you these really cool exclusive emojis that you can show off to everyone in the comments of my videos and loyalty badges that change with every month that you stay a member. And when I see that in the comments, I can prioritize responding to you. You're also going to be able to participate in members only polls and you'll get early access to some of my new videos. Second tier, this is where we get juicy. If you want to be a step up 
from a marker, you can be a Sharpie. And with this tier, you'll get exclusive members only videos, including bloopers that you can look at right now for this video. The funny parts of the videos that I couldn't include in. Plus, I'll be giving you guys some special shout outs. There will be live streams that only you guys can see. And you guys will get discounts of my merch. And if you really want to go all out, the third highest tier is a collaborator. And that will allow you to participate in one of my videos storyline. I will actually include you as a character on the channel. So you can go ahead and click the join button to become a member of the Movie Man family, the Movie Manly. And I'll see you guys in the member section. All right.